Hey cinephiles, this is our list of the top 5 films to see at 2014 South by Southwest. Number 5, Open Windows, directed by Nacho Vigalando. Elijah Wood plays Nick, a lucky fan who has won an internet contest to have dinner with popular actress Jill Godard, played by Sasha Gray. After Jill cancels the date, Nick is contacted by a mysterious man with a tempting offer. We're big fans of Vigalando's time crimes and hope this high concept thriller will live up to its promising premise. Number 4, Before I Disappear, written and directed by Sean Christensen. In 2013, Christensen won the Oscar for Best Live Action Short Film for Curfew. Therein a man, played by Christensen, about to commit suicide, gets a call from his estranged sister to babysit his niece for a few hours. Before I Disappear is a feature-length exploration and expansion of the same concept. Number 3, The Dog, directed by Alison Berg and Francois Caradron. This is a documentary portrait of the late John Boydovich, whose attempted robbery of a Brooklyn bank to finance his male lover's sex change was the real-life inspiration for Dog Day Afternoon. We're fans of the Lumet film and look forward to learning the rest of the story from people who not only knew the man, but Voidovich himself. Number 2, Joe, directed by David Gordon Green. Last year's Prince Avalanche was the closest we've come to a return to form for the once India tour, David Gordon Green. Joe is an ex-con who crosses paths with a 15-year-old boy and is faced with the choice of redemption or ruin. If the plot sounds an awful lot like last year's Mud, it will become all the more familiar with the boy being played by the ridiculously talented Ty Sheridan. Number 1. Boyhood. Directed by Richard Linklater. Linklater is no stranger to ambitious film projects. Shot over 12 consecutive years, Boyhood chronicles Mason, played by Eller Coltrane, from age 6 to 18. It looks to be a dramatized equivalent to Michael Apted's renowned Up series, making it our most anticipated film of 2014 South by Southwest.